For years now, people have been asking me, wishing that there was a way that they could keep both their hands on the instrument while they surf through my videos and study other people's videos on YouTube. Well, my friends, your prayers have been answered. I'd like to introduce you to the Vidami YouTube Looping Pedal. This foot pedal allows you to keep both your hands on the instrument while your feet rewind, pause, fast forward, slow down, and even loop different sections of the video so you can study and keep yourself in the flow of the music. I think this pedal is a game changer for anybody who's serious about learning music using video content, and I've become obsessed with it. It's so fun to use and it's really easy. I'm gonna give you a little tour of the Vidami Video Looper, show you how it works, how I use it, and how it can really serve you as a powerful tool on your music learning journey. The Vidami Video Looper saves you tons of time and frustration because you're not clicking around with your hands. You keep your hands on your instrument and touch these buttons with your feet. So let's take a look at the buttons. On the top left, you got the speed button. Each time you tap the speed button, it's gonna be slowing your video down. So you tap it once to go from 100 to 75%, then keep clicking to go to 50, 35%, and then finally 20%. If you click it up one more time, it'll go back to 100% or normal speed. Now, if you move over to the right-hand side at the top, you'll see the loop button. Now, the way it works is that you'll click it once to engage the beginning of the section you want to loop, then click it a second time at the end of the section that you want to work with. As soon as you tap it a second time, it'll start looping that section. When you're done working on the section, just click it a third time and it will clear out your loop selection. What's really cool is that the loop and the speed button work in conjunction with one another. So what that means is that once you set up a loop, you can click the speed button to move it down to the speed that you're comfortable practicing and learning with. The back button, each time you tap it, it'll rewind the video five seconds. And you can also tap and hold the back button to go back to the very beginning of the video. Over on the bottom right side, you see the forward button. Forward moves you in the other direction, of course. Tap it once to go forward five seconds at a time. And if you tap and hold the forward button, it'll just keep fast forwarding. And finally, we got the play pause button, which as you might guess, plays and pauses the video. But it also does something else. If you hold the play pause button down, it clears out whatever functions that you've enabled. So if you've set up a loop and a certain speed and you wanna clear out and begin again, just hold down the play pause button and it'll clear all your choices and you can start again. Now the pedal's not only great for isolating different sections of music, but you could use this for knitting, painting, anything that you're using your hands for, keep your hands on your work, and just use the pedals to manipulate the video. Now the kind folks who created the Vidami pedal have offered a discount. There's a link below. The discount's only good for the next two weeks. But of course, if you wanna get the pedal in the future, appreciate it if you'd use the link down below. That link, if you use it to purchase it, will help my family out just a little bit. So of course, I truly appreciate that and your support. Most importantly, I hope you check out the pedal because you know I don't review a lot of products on my channel, honestly. I only like to share things that I truly believe in. And this product is really a game changer for people who want to learn online. So let's say you wanna learn a specific lick, but it's going by way too fast. What you can do is loop and slow down a specific section. This is the video lesson for the Beatles paperback writer. Let's start a loop. The way you begin a loop is by tapping the loop to set the beginning of the loop, then tap it again to set the end of the loop. So I'm gonna to wanna to loop at the beginning of the riff. Here it comes. And here's the end of the riff. And notice what's gonna happen. It's gonna keep on repeating that one section. Yeah, I can pause the video. Notice I haven't had to use my hands at all. No mouse clicking, no futzing with the arrow keys. And now we can slow it down to an easier to learn tempo just by tapping the speed button. If I tap it once, it goes to 0.75. If I tap it again, it goes to half speed. Tap it again down to 0.35, and one more, we get all the way to super slow-mo, 0.2. Tap it one more time after 0.2, and you're back at 
standard tempo. So I'm gonna slow it down a little bit to half speed. And let's practice it. Here we go. Now it's not only great for isolating certain difficult sections, but I like to use it just to jam along. Here's another example. This video is for the Proclaimers, I'm going to be 500 miles. This is where the jam starts. So All right, y'all ready to let's jam along? say let's we're this. playing along. Two. Any way you like. But we missed the beginning. Two. One. You could just go back five seconds. Maybe you're doing this and you just are would love it to be a little slower. Well, easy peasy. All you gotta do is step on the speed button. Now it's down to 0.75. Tap the back button to go back five seconds, maybe ten seconds. Let's jam. Here we go. Three, when I wake up. That guy's voice sounds a little funny. Let's make him sleepier. And of course you can have a lot of laughs just doing it. Okay, enough of that. So as you can see, you can have a lot of fun with this as well. If you wanted to pick up the Vidami Video Looper, there are links in the description below. If you use that link in the next two weeks, you'll get a discount. If you want to get the pedal in the future, appreciate it if you'd use the link down below. That link, if you use it to purchase it, will help my family out just a little bit. So of course, I truly appreciate that. Thanks so much for watching. This is Stu from Ukulele Zen, wishing you all the best. I'll see you in another video soon.